getting people excited about this yeah. event because many people did not know about this. Like, subscribe, and turn <laughs> on the bell icon. <laughs> Sorry, cut. Hello everyone, today we'll be talking about our Learn Abroad experience at UC Berkeley. My name is Atka Saleem and I am a Social Development and Policy Senior. I am Sakina Nakwi and I am an SDP Junior. Hello, my name is Amal Iqbal, I am a Senior majoring in Social Development and Policy. Hi, my name is Laiba Ahmed, I am an Electrical Engineering Junior. <laughs> Let's get started with the questions. So, the first question is, where did you go for your Learn Abroad program and what program did you choose? So we went to University of California at Berkeley and uh, since it was an interdisciplinary slash multidisciplinary program, tha, to we had the opportunity to choose whatever courses we wanted to and it was not confined to any major or program. So how did Habib University provide you this opportunity? So basically we filled out an application uh, regard using the Office of Global Engagement and since the o Office of Global Engagement has signed MOUs with m multiple universities such as Stanford, Berkeley and Michigan so we went to Berkeley and this was a whole procedure of getting selected, giving interviews and then being finalized. How did your learning at Habib help you during your lab experience? Um, I think one of the benefits of being a student at Habib is the interdisciplinary education that it provides us and then also the diversity that you get to experience at Habib, I think that also helped us in terms of our social skills in networking and just getting to meet new people and make new friends. Habib University is a very good thing that it focuses on interdisciplinary studies and on liberal arts education. Pe focus karta hai. So that really helps you in like uh, exploring new fields of studies and just being more open to things. How much did you explore outside of academics? <laughs> so I think quite a lot. We, we went to see, I think most of us have seen whole of San Francisco from the goods to the bads. So from the touristy spots to the local spots to random even Indian stores, Indian Pakistani food stores at, in San Francisco to the Golden Gate Bridge. And I think not even just San Francisco, Berkeley itself had a lot of things yeah, to see. Exactly. And then uh, I was fortunate enough to be able to go to Silicon Valley and LA as well. So those were like one of the best experiences that I have had. What was the challenge that you had to face during lab? Uh, even though it's an academic experience, but you also have a lot of things to experience. Karne jate hai. And sometimes, um, Aap, uh, jo hai, wo balance sometimes nahi paate hai. So that can be a bit of a challenge but with time you start to realize that dono cheeze jo hai, wo bahut important hai. academic and non-academic experiences are not important hai, but trying to find that balance uh, can initially be a challenge. And I think it was the first time that all of us like traveled alone so it was just like really intimidating to go into like a completely different city and be by yourself. You had to do your laundry, take care of your whole schedule by yourself. So it was like a little challenging in the first weeks. And Again, I think that was part of the experience because we got to learn through that how to be independent and like solely rely on ourselves. What were you most looking forward to? I think I really looked forward for the whole college experience and like meeting new people, living in a dorm by yourself yeah. and we all got to experience that and it was just really good. I was able to meet people from various cultures, various countries and it was such a nice breather because you get to experience that diversity, the different cultures on a daily basis. You get to hear their life perspectives, their life stories and I just thoroughly enjoyed that experience. How did this program help you in your personal development and your future plans with reference to grad school? So after this program I feel like I got like a sense of direction about what I want to do in grad school because before this program I was like really confused. I knew I wanted to go to grad school but I didn't have like a career path in mind and this program really gave me that clarity. I met someone who was doing his PhD and we had this one-on-one -on -one conversation for over, over 45 minutes and I was able to talk out my thoughts about how I want to take my career trajectory or my grad school trajectory so that was something that helped me. Before this experience I had a very limited uh, perspective to be honest. After this experience and after understanding ke how well Habib University prepares you, I'm, I'm more open to like exploring other you know fields of education but also just exploring other uh, you know other universities abroad. 
What was the highlight of your trip during Learn Abroad? So for me, the highlight was the Eid celebration that we did. Um, uski execution planning or uh, ideation, har cheez mein itna zyada maza aaya. Ham log ko it was a collaborative effort, or it was like a brilliant opportunity to you know tell people about Eid and even Pakistani culture. On the day of Eid, uh, we went. out together and two of our international friends one from spain and one from taiwan they actually dressed up in eastern clothes just so we would feel at home and i think that was one of the sweetest most mundane thing ever really nice we had to like plan the whole event from scratch yeah. and it was in like a completely different st- uh, completely different city and we had to deal with vendors we had to like organize the food arrangement ourselves and just build the event from scratch adding on to what habib gives you so most of us are usually leading clubs here and then leading events so we had that idea that you have a certain budget we were given a budget from the i house cabinet and because of that habib experience that we had we were able to manage all of that stuff do you have any advice for students who want to apply for this program I think the only advice I would give anybody who's applying for it is to explore and have fun. Academics and everything aside, this is your one opportunity to just explore and find your strengths, find what you want to do, socialize with people and just enjoy to the most. You won't get this amazing opportunity to see other cities, go abroad and just have fun. If I talk about myself, maine ek course kiya tha forensic anthropology. और दूसरा मैंने कोर्स किया था दैट वाज अबाउट यूएस मार्केट्स एंड कंज्यूमरिज्म तो बहुत डिफरेंट कोर्सेज हैं बट इट्स एन अमेजिंग अपॉर्चुनिटी टू लर्न समथिंग न्यू राइट सो आई थिंक डिफरेंट कोर्सेज लें वही चीज़ें ना पढ़ें जो हबीब में पढ़ता है डिस्क्राइब योर लर्न अब्रॉड एक्सपीरियंस इन वन वर्ड इन रिचिंग मेमरीज रिविटिंग इंस्पायरिंग I hope you all enjoyed the video and learned something about our experience and I really hope that you all also apply for the learn abroad experience. Thank you so much. Bye. Bye.